so this morning I was saying my prayers and I found myself, um, I have a lot of friends who are going through a lot of things. And so I found myself praying for each one of them individually. And obviously as I was praying about them, I was thinking about them and then I go through my family and I have a very, very large family. And as I was praying, my heart was so filled with love for love for so many different people. Um, they all have different, different trials. Uh, they're all from different parts of the world and they have different um, needs and different, they're different than even from me, you know, not all of them are my faith, not all of them are, are, are like me, but yet I just have this love. And as you make connections in the world, and as you uh, start to see everybody, everybody as children of God, as your brothers and sisters, your prayers change. So it's very, very, very easy. Maybe not very easy, but to pray for your family and those you love because you know them and obviously they're your family you're going to pray for them but how um when you start looking at your neighbors you're supposed to love thy neighbors as thyself but if you look at your neighbors that they are also children of god or you look at uh, even your friends or associates or people if you start looking at them as they too are children of god they too um, are your brother and sister and you start praying for just others not just yourself but for others it, at least I found I was filled with this, just this love that Christ has and he loves everybody so much And one way I can learn how to, how to understand that love is to try to love everybody. It's not easy. But as you learn about people and you learn uh, their life and their story, that it changes, right? It changes once you know more. I mean, that's why I start out my... My perfectly patty with here was my life. Here's here's what I've kind of been through. Here's what's going on. It's not at all perfect, not even close. But it's perfect for me. Because all the hard things I've gone through has brought me closer to Christ. And so that's I'm perfectly me. I'm perfectly patty because of all these hard, hard things I've gone through or these things that have, that have gotten me closer to Christ. And things you work for, you appreciate more, right? Right? When you're invested in something and you work, then you love it more. And I just... The more we learn about everyone, everyone all over the world, everyone who's, who's different than us, the more we learn about them, the more we begin to understand. And once we understand, you can't help but love. And is that what we're... Is that kind of ideally what we should be doing? It's easy to assume 
But what does assuming do? Haven't you ever heard that phrase? Assuming, if you assume something, you make an ass out of you and me. I think you've heard that. But once you really hear that everybody has something and don't assume anything, And just realize that. And thank goodness our Heavenly Father is the one who will judge because we don't know everything. But He knows our heart. And so He just asks us to love everybody and give them the benefit of the doubt. And don't worry. Don't worry. He knows everybody's heart. And I'm thankful for that. I'm thankful for that knowledge. I'm thankful that as I think about others more than myself, how I'm filled with love. Is that what charity is? The pure love of Christ? Because we all need each other. And it's nice to know, as silly as people mock the phrase, you know, I'll pray for you. I know that when I feel that, I do feel lifted when I hear that about me, when people say that. I, I, I don't understand how it works, but it does. It does work. It does. <laughs> so get out. Look out. Get to know those around you. And open your eyes and see everyone. Because we're all brothers and sisters. We're all children of God. Have a wonderful, wonderful weekend.